Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a try on haul for you guys. This is going to be a end of winter haul, kind of pushing into the spring. Yeah, the three companies that I got stuff from is Sammy Dress, CN Direct, if I'm not mistaken, and accessory galore. So this is going to be like a combination type of haul where I have accessories because I did that in my last haul, I think. Okay, so I'm not going in any specific order. I'm just pulling stuff from this lovely box. The first thing that I picked up are these halter tops that are in a size large. And when I was looking at them on the website, I got them because I seen them on social media and people were trying to figure out where to get them from. So when I saw them, I was just like, oh my gosh, I, I need them. But anyways, I thought they were going to be like a sports bra type of material that like kind of sucks in. Well, not sucks in, but holds your girls or boobies. <laughs> this material is really stretchy as you guys can see. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of a bathing suit top. Like literally if I would put this with some bathing suit bottoms people wouldn't even know that this is supposed to be a halter top. And then I got a pink one of course. I got this living in dreamland pullover but it's not really a pullover. It's like a pullover crop top. I got a large but it doesn't fit like a large. It fits like a medium that's supposed to be cropped. Y'all know what I'm talking like an oversized sweat type of baggy shirt that you can just throw on and still look kind of cute. If it's snug especially on my arms and it's not long enough so yeah that's that. So the next thing I got is this sweater this cream off-white sweater that has a rounded high neck and it has slits on the sides so the sides are exposed. I just like how this sweater looks on. I thought it was going to be a little bit more fuzzy like you can cuddle with it or something like that. <laughs> so yeah a nice trendy white sweater. Next thing I got is this dress. I try to step out of my element with the red because I even though I do have red in my closet and it's just like a it's like a zip up. I wanted to like get a red dress because I don't really wear too much of any color but it didn't really work out um so yeah I got this dress it has a curved hem at the bottom of the dress it's in a size extra large and it is too short for me okay so the next thing I got is this demi styled button up dress I like it but then again it doesn't feel like jean material it's like really thin fabric which I don't mind because it's going to be breathable so I can wear it during the springtime and the length of it is a little risque it fits really well except for like right here it's a little snug but I still like it it's cute I'm still going to get some wear out of it so that is that so the next thing I got is this faux fur vest. When I seen this, I was just like, I want you because I don't have you. And it fits really, really well. It has pockets on the side, um, but the pockets seem to be too, like, they're not in front of the body. They're like right, like a little bit behind. I don't know. The pockets are just positioned weirdly i got this in a size xxxl so i will probably like pair this with like a black dress or like a all demi outfit with some nude heels i'm definitely going to get some wear out of this hopefully so the next thing i got is a jacket i thought this was going to be a trench type cloth material jacket but it's a rain jacket i still like it and everything i like the design of it which is why i got it because when i seen it i was just like yo that jacket is like dope and like i need it in my closet so like i just had to get it and i like the brown accent color that's on the jacket i literally love this jacket it's like so cute you can make it look street style or you can make it look dressed up by zipping the jacket all the way up and it makes your waist go in a little bit the only downside about it is that it's a rain jacket not a regular jacket but you know i'm still gonna wear it the next thing i got that i am absolutely disappointed with with is this right here um this is not going to work out like i'm not wearing this shiny thing like no so that's it for the clothing part of this haul and now i'm going to move on to the accessories and the bags 
just because it's sitting right in front of me. I got this watch from Accessory Galore and it's rose gold. So the next thing I got from Accessory Galore, I got this biker jacket inspired purse. It has feet at the bottom of it. This purse feels really, really structured. It has a whole bunch of pockets, pockets on both sides like a jacket and then it has a pocket in the back and then inside it just has your standard maybe I should take this out and on the inside it just has your standard pockets and it comes with a strap that you can attach onto the bag if you want to and then I got a bag from one of those Asian websites or Chinese websites I'm not sure I got a book bag from them but I thought this was going to be bigger like my actual book bag on my door right there. I want to be able to fit my laptop in it and I feel like this bag looks a little different in person and it makes too much noise. So I'll probably end up giving this to my sister or something or my niece so yeah. I got this little earring. I feel like I would wear this with like an all white outfit with like a little dainty necklace and just have this be the star of the show. Never had one of these before so I'm really excited to actually wear it. I'm not sure where I'm going to wear it to because I don't go anywhere. But when I do wear it, my outfit has to be on point. And then I got this, <sighs> y'all, this little bib necklace is freaking beautiful this just screams spring like easter sunday i have to find something that is going to make this necklace pop so the last items that i got is these glasses that i've hauled before because in my last video not my last video in my last haul i got these little circle glasses and you guys said they look really really cute on me so I decided to wear them without makeup and then they slowly grew on me and now I actually love how they look on so even though my cheeks kind of get in the way but I can't really help that. And I got a black pair and I got a brown pair because I thought I lost the other ones that look similar to this but my niece ended up finding these pair, well the other pair that looks like these that I thought I lost in the car. To end off this video I have a coupon code for you guys. So Accessory Galore sent me like a little customized letter and they said thank you so much again for collaborating with Accessory Galore. Truly appreciate it. I hope you like your accessories and get good cute use out of them. Much love XOXO. Coupon code for your subbies. Shani1. 10% off total order. So I'll leave that in the description box for you guys. I hope you guys like this haul and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a review video on these curly clippings that I have in my hair right now. At first, I'm not gonna lie, I did not like these clippings because I could not get them to match my hair or I don't know, I just couldn't get them to look right. Maybe because I don't do my natural hair too often.